what I want to talk about in Make Code Arcade is placing and moving sprites. So when we create a sprite, if I take from the sprites set sprite position to and then a number block, uh, you can see that now when the game reloads over here, it's going to place the sprite at a position on screen that's 120 pixels over and 33 pixels down. Uh, so the 00, zero the origin is in this upper left corner here. Now, when I position that, this block actually allows me not only to change the numbers with a slider or by typing them in, but I can also use this crosshairs, which is super convenient. I can just say, you know what, I want my sprite to begin the game right in this position so I can place it. Uh, now, if we want to move it around, inside of this controller block, I have move sprite with buttons. So now if I come over here and I can use my arrow keys to move my Adabot sprite around. Now you'll notice a couple things. It is moving off the screen, uh, which you may or may not want for your game. And there's a very easy way to keep it on screen, which is also in sprites, I have, it's into this area called effects, set my sprite stay on screen on or off. And there's actually a couple of options uh, that you can use here, but I'm gonna set this to stay in screen on. And now when the game reloads and I move my cursors, you'll see it stops. And that's why I drew those red marks into there, just to show you that no matter what you draw, your sprite is gonna be a certain dimension. This is 16 by 16 pixels in this case. So the corners of that are gonna hit these walls and that's where your sprite is gonna stop. Uh, and the last thing is a really convenient little block in that same area called uh, show physics on or off. And all that does is give us coordinates and velocity. So we can see which direction we're traveling in with that V line. And we can see what coordinate we have reached with the upper left corner, I believe it is, of the sprite. And so lastly, what I wanna do is show you in the overhead here, I'm using buttons, I've got a TFT display, and I have a Feather M4 running this. And you can see we've got the same thing live on a real game style display. So that is how you set the position of a sprite and move it around really easily inside of Make Code Arcade.